we're here at the Elephant's Truck Flea Market. I feel like I'm shopping for camera lenses with Scorsese. Because you're like the Scorsese of flea markets, and you're totally prepared. I am. Tell me what you have. What do you bring? Well, usually I bring my, I bring a backpack that is then filled with um, extra bags. I bring um, so you in here... Uh, measuring tape, all kinds oh of stuff gosh, that you're, you're so going to need. Ready. Just because you never know like what you're going to find and you don't want to find find something, buy it, and then have it not fit. I love the idea of a measuring tape. Like you have to. I also bring in your, in your um, like my paint swatches that I'm working on for a room makeover just in case I find art or you know something wow. that I okay. want to just be able to be like, okay, this is going to work because you only have one time to buy it yes. before it goes away. Yes, <laughs> you are so smart. Okay, I'm very excited. Right, Let's cool. go in. Yep, like things like this. I mean, you know, these are the kind of things that you can buy to add interior. You know, you just add to your house and it adds interest. I mean, sand it down and like refinish it so it looks fresh and not like that shabby chic, which I'm not a fan of. <laughs> what I also love about you is that you're unafraid to put a little work into it. Totally. Some people think, oh, well, it's yucky. Forget it. But the whole point... Is, is that you find it for a deal and then you make it better. And then, of course, when you have it in your house, people say, how did you find that? I can never find it. It's like, well, he Because it started little... off like this. It started <laughs> off like this. This was the before. So I start off in the back and work my way forward okay. because everyone starts in the front, so oh, the best stuff okay. is still left in the back. Oh, okay. So let's go there. Say Wouldn't those be really pretty for Thanksgiving Absolutely. with, like, transfer wear yes. on a... Uh, and then, I'm, look at these. I love the staghorn. And then, do you know, love. okay, like, if you look here, let's see, how much are these? These are... I mean, those are hard to find. Not yeah, sure. these are $45, mm -hmm. but it's then... sterling. Yeah, and when you look down in the oh, bottom, it says so sterling right here. It has the anchor, which means that they're gorum. Mm-hmm. And I mean, $45. You can have the blades repaired, and you just bring that to, like, a jeweler, and they can order new blades. And ah. so, I would never replace, I like the old I do where too. you can have a new but, blade oh, put in. And it. you know what I've done too in the oh, past is I've bought, I've bought pieces like this, and then I have them monogrammed and give them away as wedding gifts. Wow. And it's just great like a really, idea. really great little oh, yeah, something. I always try to like set a budget too. Like today I came with like $200 because right. I'm not feeling too rich. But you know, sometimes yeah. I'll, but then sometimes you'll find something and I'm like, all right, I'll, I'll, I'll go, I'll go for for this. Right. But I'm sure also today it's going to be about the littler things. The little smalls. Right. Yep. The little smalls. The little smalls. Now these things right here, like I love looking through bins like this because... The stuff that you can find is really cool. A nut pick, which I love. Look at look at what you're finding. Look, look at what. But you're then unearthing. look at this. This is from an old hotel. This has a gorgeous CC monogram on it, and this is a master butter knife. But I can already I would use see you for, shining them up. Yeah, I would use this for um, a cheese knife. And what I've done, what I have done too, is I buy these. And then, you know, when you're going to someone's house and you're like, oh, let me just go and grab like some cheese and crackers. Uh -huh. You just like throw this in and you're like, oh, here, you get to keep this after all the cheese is gone. To the table. Uh -huh. I mean, the glass alone would be $200. You're right. You know? Yep. And I love that base. It's very Kelly Wurstler. And that will clean up really, yeah. clean up really beautifully. So 200, 200 deal, right? Yeah. And then you bring it down to New York and you put a one in front of it. Voila. I just pulled it out. But he'll do 20 if you want. Uh, okay, I'll take it. Oh, that's so good. It's English copper. It's 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 like silver over copper, and it's like a really beautiful little inkwell. Great, thank you. Mm -hmm. Again, my life is a prop. Let's talk about bargaining quickly. You owe, if someone says five, you you do, do, do like what's well, your for threshold? Five dollars. Well, the thing is, you don't want to insult the dealers. Of course, yeah. You want to be able to work with them. So I always use it as an example, like something that's seventy-five dollars. Like I would say, okay, can you do fifty? Right. I wouldn't say like, oh, I'll give you twenty bucks on because they'll tell you to get out of right. here. Right. And do you find that when you say fifty, you both know that he's going to say one more number? Exactly. And then you'll Even get at it a place for like, like fifty-five. This. Yeah. Okay. And you still walk out of there with a good, with right. a good deal. We're wrapping it up, but what yeah. I love what you told me once is that never look at a flea market like 
it's going to change your life that one and only time. Because people, oh, I didn't find that table. That's not why you come. No. You're a perfect example of the internal optimism. Exactly. You have to come and check it out all the time. It's like you never know what you're going to find. You might have something in your head, but you have to, you know, look at things and options and not just be so honed in on knowing, like, this is what you want because... You know, I came looking for like tabletop and I found this great found like this mid-century great lamp. lamp and I mean you found a mirror. I, I found mean, I this found, mirror. It's I found kind a of gravy exciting. boat. You know, it's like It's a good day. It's a good it's When a you good go day. home with a gravy boat that's that fabulous for two dollars, it's the gift that keeps giving. It's a gift that keeps on giving because you know, it's not just for gravy. <laughs> it's not just for gravy. <laughs> it's not just for gravy anymore. <laughs> I think that everyone can learn not just flea market tips from you but your internal optimism about life in general you never know what's behind the corner you have to go low you have to go high you have to dig deep and you have to think of the potential of everything absolutely it's thank so you. true thank You're you <laughs>